Hello, my name is Oswaldo Angeles. I am CEO of IoT Robotics. Uh, we design, we manufacture, and we market uh, IoT devices. We have uh, about uh, five years that we are working with IoT. Our first product uh, was an electronic card for fridges. Uh, we measure uh, variables such as uh, temperature, uh, number of door openings, um, how many times the fridge was turned off, and many more. But uh, the, 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 main, the main thing is the information uh, was sent to Azure, to the cloud. That was uh, our first product. And we made a, a deployment of about 1.5K devices. About two years ago, uh, we were invited to develop electronic devices uh, for Microsoft. With time, we became a partner uh, for hardware, for IoT. First of all, uh, we analyze all the requirements of the client. Then we consult our database. Our database is like a Lego. We have uh, different parts of, of electronic circuits that we al already uh, proved. So we are sure that all the things that we put together will work and, and will make a, a very successful device be because of the, the experience. Also, uh, we try to, uh, to bring to the client our experience, uh, telling uh, that there are many uh, things that we could do to make it better. We think that the most important elements are the communications and uh, the, the sensors. The, the, those, those two things are, are very important because that will let us bring the information to the cloud. A technology for communications, uh, we are open to, to use many of them. Obviously, each one has uh, pros uh, and cons, but we have uh, used Wi-Fi, Ethernet, uh, Sigfox, GPRS, um, Bluetooth, um, you name it. First of all, we have to see the environment in which the application will, will work. In that way, uh, we choose which technology will, will bring better results. Uh, at the end, uh, you can use many, many uh, communication technologies, but uh, for example, Wi-Fi uh, will depend on if there is uh, energy on, on your house, for example. No? Sigfox instead is, it is, is uh, independent of, of that. So if we are going to put a panic button in your home, we are not going to use Wi-Fi. We are going to use, for example, Sigfox. As I said before, uh, you have to meet uh, the requirements of your client or the application. But secondly, uh, you have to give uh, a little more based on your, on your experience because most of the time the client uh, misses some uh, details, important details that you know it can uh, make it better. So uh, in, in our experience, we follow the, the requirements of, of our clients, but we try to, to combine our experience with the needs of the client. After many iterations, after, after many trials and failures, there is a point in which you can tell that product is ready because you meet all the needs uh, for the application and everything works perfectly. Once is, is, is that, you have to, to make a little proof of concept uh, putting all the, well, a few devices on, on field to see how it behaves. 
because it's very different when you work on, on the laboratory. Everything is perfect. And once you go to the field, uh, sometimes uh, you find that there is interference, there is a noise on the line, you know, of electric line, etc. So in that point that when the product is uh, working okay in the field, you are ready to the next step. The biggest challenge we have faced is learning, investigating, uh, investing is, is the most challenging because you don't know everything. So you have to take time to investigate and, and see that there is a lot of things that you can do, but you need time. The ecosystem uh, is very interesting because there are many tools or, or there are many partners that could help us. Um, there are uh, software partners, there are hardware partners. Uh, me as a, as a manufacturer, uh, we, we need uh, partners for, for TI, you know, because it's, very, it's kind of difficult to design a product, an, an electronic car in, uh, specifically, and at the same time uh, develop a, a platform or, or uh, all the services on the cloud. So uh, sometimes we, are, we make partnership with these kind of, of companies that help us to, to, to show the information on the cloud. If you have an idea and you dream with it and you know it can help somebody, uh, the only thing that you have to do is use your imagination and make it happen. That's what I can say. What we see for the near future is that with, with all the information that we are gathering, uh, we will uh, have more power to make better decisions, to save money, to save time, and have, for example, better services, uh, more security and many things is, is, is what I see and I think we still do not know exactly what will happen uh, we are making iterations with the new solutions we have to try it all and, uh, uh, and see what will happen because we are I'm not sure exactly uh, which will be the impact on, on, on our lives but I can tell that will help to save money, time, uh, better, uh, uh, better decisions, and we hope it make a better world. We are IoT Robotics and we are connecting things. <laughs>